everyone! I'm super excited to be bringing you what my two-year-old is getting for Christmas this year. Um, last year, if you saw our video, she was one, and so we decided to do the three gift Christmas. And it worked great! Now that she's two and a little bit into more unwrapping the gifts and everything, I really couldn't stick with the three gift thing. So, she has a few more than that, um, but every year might be a little bit different. So this year, Maddie is mostly getting things that I bought years ago even. I like to shop Amazon sales and sales stores and stock up for things. I also got a couple of items from some local friends, um, things that they had new or gently used for free. So she's getting some of those too. I'll leave links below where you can find these items all except for the very first one, which is a mini mouse princess plushie and it says Disney Parks on it and this one I got my from my friend so I think they got it at like Disneyland so you can't like buy it online um, unless you want to pay like crazy amounts on eBay but <laughs> don't do that so it's almost like new condition it's really cute Maddie will absolutely adore it so that is the first thing she's getting the next thing she also got, um, we got Like New from a friend. This is Sophia the First. Um, this book is The Curse of Princess Ivy. Maddie is obsessed with Princess Sophia. So a picture book of Sophia is perfect. She will adore this. And then the third thing that we got for free um, from a friend is this Little People Zoo Animal Friends and it's brand new in packaging. Um, I'm super excited about this because Maddie does love animals and we don't really have any of the little people stuff. Um, we do have my childhood bus with the, you know, the little people when they were hard, like hard plastic and yellowed and everything. So she plays with that, um, but we don't have any of the new stuff. So I'm really excited to have these for her. And then the final three things we got out of our storage bin here. Um, she's not super into puzzles yet. I'm hoping hoping that two brings us this. Uh, but this is the Melissa and Doug fish colors puzzle. I got this in a set of three. I'll have both this one and the set of three linked below so you can see. Um, the set of three on Amazon came with the colors and then also the um, the numbers and the ABCs. I didn't feel like she was quite ready for the numbers and ABCs, um, but we are working on colors. She knows some of them, so I thought maybe fishies would be somewhat a of interest to her. Then the next thing is a Melissa and Doug's lacing bead set. And yes, I know it's ages three and up. Um, I assume that has to do with the size of the beads, possibly also um, just development level. This is something that I plan to put in a box <laughs> out of her reach and bring it down for a time together where we can sit down and lace them together um, kind of as more a preschool activity um, than something that's just like out all the time. Uh, she loves to string like wooden spools together. My parents have that at their house, but she doesn't really have anything like that here. So that's why I'm deciding to give this to her this year instead of when she's three. And the very last thing is yet another Melissa and Doug wooden toy. This is the beginner pattern blocks for two and up. And I love these. She also has in the future, the classic pattern blocks, <laughs> things like I used to play with as a kid. Uh, but the beginner ones are super cool. I don't know if you can see that, but they have indentations kind of like a wooden puzzle with these big pieces and everything. So I'm really excited for her to have this because I think it'll kind of maybe help her with her puzzle phobia um, and be something that we can sit down and do together and work on shapes and colors and all of that. So that is what Maddie is getting for Christmas this year. I hope that gave you some good gift ideas for what two-year-olds might like. Um, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.